I'm Erica Wright. And I'm Ray Parisi. We both produce stories for CNBC on super high-end luxury real estate. This video has four homes with the most insane pools that you've ever seen. From the wild water world Celine Dion built in her backyard to a mansion with a haunted water park in the back. And we're gonna start with the spookiest. Here's number four. Everything's bigger in Texas, even the real estate. Before we show you what's out back, let's take a quick look inside. This place unfolds over 37,000 square feet. And check this out. We found a secret passage hidden behind this bookcase. It leads to the second level where there's a giant game room and movie theater. But that's just the tip of the iceberg when it comes to entertainment. The owner also purchased the $6 million mansion next door and connected them. And turned this whole place into the fun house. There's a basketball court that can be turned into Party Central. Check out the DJ booth perched on a glass balcony that overlooks the court. This party pad also has a virtual reality sports simulator. Bowling alley. Another movie theater just for the kids. And a room full of bunk beds for the ultimate slumber party. But the fun really goes into hyperdrive in the backyard. Which looks like a full-blown amusement park. The 750,000 gallon pool has three giant water slides. And to give you the full effect, our camera guy strapped on a GoPro and took the plunge. There's also a zip line that dumps you into the pool. And water cannons for soaking your buddies. But this is the absolute craziest part of this water park. It's the lazy river, which seems relaxing until it's totally not. It flows into a grotto where things get creepy. Super creepy. It's crawling with mummies, bats, and other spooky animatronics. And if you're wondering how much a haunted water cave and all the wet and wild rides cost? Well, we asked, and the owner said it soaked him for about 10 million bucks. How cool would it be to grow up in that house? Or scary. <laughs> This next house is not scary at all. It belongs to Celine Dion. It's got one of the biggest pools you've ever seen. Here's CNBC's Robert Frank with house number three. It's a home like no other we've ever been invited to. Welcome to Celine Dion's jaw-dropping estate on Jupiter Island, one of the most exclusive communities in not just Florida, but on the entire planet. You really are in your own world when you come through the gates here. The Diva's secluded mansion has 486 feet of unspoiled beachfront. But the epic view of the Atlantic is just the beginning. Celine built her own private ocean in the backyard. Much of the almost six acre compound is an aquatic paradise. It's a 460,000 gallon dream come true for kids includes a titanic-sized private water park with two slides that spill into a flowing river. Those are water cannons up and down, so you can be bombarded as you float down the lazy river. The currents carry you around Celine's private water world, under several bridges, and into three perfectly crafted beaches designed for sand-free sunbathing. If somebody really wanted their own private water park for their kids, you really couldn't build this again on Jupiter Island, could you? This is not replaceable and not reproducible. Celine hired super broker Adrian Reed to sell her one of a kind $45.5 million island retreat. The peace and the beauty of it is just hard to match. And that's no exaggeration. There's a luxurious pool house, a fabulous gazebo for poolside dining, a tennis court that can also be used for shooting hoops, and an elegant beachfront cabana for massages. And at the very center of the infinity pool is the property's hottest feature, a fire pit lounge built into the pool. Are these little bars right here? Swim up bar, sure. You can eat lunch or have a drink in the afternoon. So you could comfortably fit 15 to 20 people on this property and still not run into each other a lot. I think you could hide 15 people on this property and never find them. 
Inside the 18,000 square foot main house, the living room has walls that disappear to create the ultimate indoor-outdoor entertainment area. Before we tell you how much it sold for, here's a quick price history on Celine's Florida Digs. She originally listed the place for $72.5 million. When no one bit, she dropped the price to $45.5 million. And after our shoot, someone finally scooped it up for a fraction of the asking price. It sold for just 28 million bucks. That was by far the chicest water park I've ever seen. If that's a thing. That's a thing. Okay, this next house has a backyard modeled after a famous luxury resort in the Caribbean. The Backyard Atlantis is number two. This fancy 11,000 square foot mansion in Boca Raton, Florida sits on six and a half acres. But its wildest feature is out back where the owners built a resort-sized private water park. It's got slides, a lazy river, and a swim-up bar for sipping champagne. <laughs> Broker Sonata Adjim says her clients spent two years and two and a half million dollars to build out this 170,000 gallon party pool. My client went to the Atlantis Resort in the Bahamas and was truly inspired what he saw. And so he came back and recreated it. And the Atlantis inspiration is everywhere. Both properties have water slides that are built on Mayan-style stone structures surrounded by palm trees with cascading waterfalls. There's even a koi pond that surrounds the hot tub. It's inspired by the shark-filled lagoon at the Bahamas Resort. The owner actually built this for himself and his family. He's got four children and he wanted them to enjoy full water park at their own home instead of going back to the Bahamas all the time. After our shoot, the mansion and backyard resort sold for 5.5 million bucks. That whole setup almost makes me want to live in Boca. Almost. <laughs> but the next house is in Miami, and it's one of my favorites. You can escape from your bedroom in a water slide. Here's number one. It makes you sexier, it makes you hotter. Broker Eloy Carminate is really into this 19,000 square foot listing in Miami. And it's just screaming sex. It also screams over the top. There's a private basketball court. A million bucks worth of art hanging on the walls. A $300,000 kitchen. And a wall of sliding glass doors that reveal where the real fun starts. The epic backyard has a giant pool. And a quarter million dollar water slide. With its own glass staircase. That was actually brought in and delivered on a barge and craned out to the property because it weighed several tons. Now you can get out of bed and slide from the master bedroom right into the pool. That's your wake up. So you feel like you're diving into the ocean in the middle of the Caribbean, and it's just screaming sex. A buyer heard those screams loud and clear. And scooped it up for 24 million bucks. So my master bedroom in New York City has a fire escape, so this would be a huge upgrade for me. Uh, out of all the houses you've seen, which one would you want to live in? 100% hands down, Celine Down's house. Me too. Roommates. Roommate. Ah. Nice. Speaking of Celine's house, we have some crazy outtakes from that shoot, including this one where I strapped on a GoPro to ride the slide. Anyone ever tell you that you scream like a 12-year-old girl? Wow, no, you're the first. And hopefully this next outtake makes everyone forget what you just said. Wait, is that Robert Frank sliding down Celine Dion's water slide in a suit? Yeah, he's trying to. His suit is literally soaking up so much water that it's slowing him down big time. That suit's ruined. And check this out, I even got the underwater shot of him too. It's crazy. That's the money shot. And this is cool. It's the bouncing view from Celine's backyard trampoline. You call this work? Yes, and it was very hot that day. By the way, can you see who that is in the lazy river? Oh my god, is that Robert floating around in his sopping wetsuit? We were looking for any excuse to get in that water. I got you something. It's a bathing suit for by the pool. Great, and it matches your shirt. Let us know your favorite in the comments. Don't forget to follow, like, and subscribe so you can keep up with all our new videos. And follow us on Facebook, too. If you're lucky enough to still be watching, we got a little video bonus for you. This is what it's like to float around in the lazy river at Celine's house. Wow, this is really soothing. Just sit back and enjoy the ride. See, See you, you next time. time.